Hello, thank you for joining me on this Lenten journey. I will be doing these devotionals throughout the season of Lent, uh, and I hope that you find it valuable. How they're going to work is I'll have a quote from a prominent Christian figure, a scripture reading, and then a, a meditation followed by a few thoughts or, or things to take into action for the day. So let's begin today, day one, with a quote from St. Francis de Sales. Have patience with all things, but first of all, with yourself. Scripture reading today comes from 1 Peter 5, 6. Humble yourselves, therefore, under the mighty hand of God, so that he may exalt you in due time. And the meditation today comes from Richard Foster, uh, book Freedom of Simplicity. He writes, the Desert Fathers renounced speech in order to learn compassion. A charming story is told of Abbot Marcarus, who said to the brethren in the church of Sicta, brethren, flee. Perplexed, one of the brothers asked, who can we fly further than this from, seeing we are here in the desert? Marcarus placed his finger on his mouth and said, flee from this. When Arrhenius, the Roman educator who gave up his status and wealth for the solitude of the desert, prayed, Lord, lead me into the way of salvation. He heard a voice say, be silent. Silence frees us from the need to control others. One reason we can hardly bear to remain silent is that it makes us feel so helpless. We are accustomed to relying upon words to manage and control others. A frantic stream of words flows from us in an attempt to straighten others out. We want so desperately for them to agree with us, to see things our way. We evaluate people, judge people, condemn people. We devour people with our words. Silence is one of the deepest disciplines of the spirit, simply because it puts a stopper on all of that. Interesting thoughts from Richard Foster, and I hope they uh, get your mind and your heart moving today. So I want to leave you with four thoughts or actions or things to consider for the day. They'll be the same every day, but I hope they remind us to enjoy this Lenten season and to get the most out of it. The first is, what spiritual act or kindness have you done or will you do today to make it memorable? So what, what, what is the one act or kindness that you've done today that makes the day more memorable for you? Second, what are you praying for? What are you praying for today or what have you prayed for today? The third is, what lesson have I learned today or will, or will you learn? today. Finally, what is it about today that I'm grateful for? What is it about today that you're grateful for? Well, I'm grateful that you're here with me, and I hope that you enjoyed this devotional, and uh, we'll look forward to the other devotionals. Uh, if you enjoy them, please tell others. Uh, come back. You can review them. They'll be on the YouTube channel, and God bless you today. Amen.